So, uh, good morning, everyone, and welcome to the third meeting in session five of the Standards, Procedures, and Public Appointment Committee. Um, you know, welcome everyone today. Um, and if we can look to the agenda, um, uh, the first item on the agenda is the decision on taking business in private. The committee will decide to take item four in the agenda in private. Is that agreed? Agreed. 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 Thank you very much. And the second item of the agenda is to decide whether to take future consideration of reports from the Commissioner and its own draft reports on complaints in private and also that the committee decide whether to take future consideration of draft reports and draft standing order rule changes and mandatory committee remits in private in the future. Is that agreed? Agreed. Thank you very much. Um, if we can move to uh, agenda item three, which is um, uh, the committee's consideration of our future work programme. And um, I would invite general comments from the members uh, on the, the work carried forward from last session and the proposals um, prepared by the clerks going forward. And I don't think there's uh, any great need for a, a, a radical change to the, to the work programme as it's presented. I think uh, the, the one thing that's moved on is the issue of parliamentary liaison officers, where we've seen a, a change to previous practice by the, the government. And I think it would be worth our while uh, using the time that we had intended to, to use for that issue to consider whether there needs to be any uh, greater clarity about the definition of that role. Uh, and potentially uh, whether that needs to be reflected in standing orders as well. Uh, it might be worth our while discussing that with the Scottish Government in the first instance. Are there any other comments on the issue of PLOs, uh, Mr yeah, Scott? I would um, I agree with uh, what Patrick has just said. Um, I think it would be very welcome if Minister of Parliament perhaps uh, were to be invited to come to this committee and just um, explain to us how he sees the future evolving in this new environment and um, we would make him very welcome here. OK. Uh, Mr Johnson? And, and, and similarly, I, I would just firstly like to, to, to agree with Mr Harvey, um, but also to, to ask that the that, um, uh, report is uh, compiled looking at similar roles in other legislatures um, so that we can uh, look at comparative practices. Okay. Any other comments? I thank the committee for their consideration of this issue. Obviously, um, it, it has moved forward considerably in the last um, a few, few weeks. Um, so I, I would suggest that um, uh, we seek that clarity that's uh, required of the committee by writing to the government and asking them their position on the PLOs, inviting the minister to come and discuss how he feels that will work going forward, given that it is a change to committee rules and also um, to ask SPICE to provide a comparative paper on other legislatures so that we can have an indication of what happens elsewhere. Are the committee content with that, those proposals yes. going forward? Thank you very much. And in terms of the rest of the, the work programme, is everyone content to go forward? Um, we've had a request from the presiding officer to um, carry out two specific pieces of work, um, one on the standing order remits and mandatory committees of the Parliament, and also um, to examine the issue of future gender balance in the, the corporate body of the Parliament. Uh, is everyone content to go forward with those bits of work? Thank you very much. Um, is, is, are there any other items not included uh, in the papers that, um, that the members feel that they may wish to to examine going forward? Not at the moment, not at the moment. Thank you very much. It will be a, a, my intention to review the work programme at a regular basis over the course of the year to make sure that um, the work of this committee is, is meeting the requirements of the, the Parliament going forward. So thank you very much for that. Started on in the time being. <laughs> and, uh, I'm quite certain that over the session work will evolve and become obvious that we need to address and be time enough then. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, on that note, we'll be moving to agenda item four and moving into private session. <laughs> 